Hello and welcome to another workout video. If you are new to my channel, I am Denise. I am a personal trainer, a nutrition coach, gym owner, and I believe that balance is the key to everything in life. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please do as I upload at least one video a week and therefore you will be notified and you will not miss out on anything that I post. Please stick around until the very end of the video after the workout because I have a really important question that I want to ask you and it is very important because it will determine how future workout videos are. So please stick around for that. Moving on. Today we are doing an all over dumbbell body workout. All you're going to need is a mat and a pair of dumbbells. So this workout is split into four sections. So in the first section, we're working the biceps, we're going into squats and we're going into lunges, and then we're combining it all and we're doing it twice. We're then moving on to our triceps, into squat, into a press. In the third section, we are doing push-ups with a renegaded row. And then in the fourth section, we are doing our glute bridges with our sit-ups. As I do for most workouts, there will be a we talk over demonstration at the beginning of the workout, just to ensure that we all know what we're doing and no one's gonna get hurt and we're gonna get the most out of this workout. If you don't need this and you know what you're doing, I will pop up on the screen the timestamp that you can fast forward to so you can skip this and you can just get stuck right into your workout. So give it your all. And if you need to make it a wee bit harder, you can add in some reps. Don't be having too much rest. Of course, if you need rest, have a wee bit, but just don't take the piss and get stuck back in. Enjoy your workout and remember to stick around until the end. Now, if you're still here and you haven't fast forwarded, that means you're here for the demonstration. So let's get stuck right in so that we can feast at this workout. Firstly, if you need rest, rest, but don't take the piss. If you want to make it harder, up your rep range and lower your rest. Most importantly, don't ego lift. This workout is about being able to do the whole workout with one set of weights. So go lighter than what you probably want to, so that you can get the most out of this workout. So just be mindful of the weight that you're going to lift. Let's do this! Our first exercise is our bicep curls. So stand nice and strong with your shoulders back and a slight bend in your knees. With your arms by your side, you want to keep your elbows nice and close to your body with your palms facing forward. You want to keep your upper arms stationary and you're going to curl the weight, contracting your biceps, giving your bicep a nice squeeze before lowering the weight and repeating. We are then going to combine our bicep curls with our step out squat. So as you curl up your weight and contract your bicep, step one foot out to the side for a wide squat. So while you're contracting your biceps, keep your core tight and your shoulders back and squat down. You're then going to push up, bring that foot in while lowering your weight and repeating. Use the same leg to step out for this round. We are now going to combine our bicep curl with our lunge. So keeping your back straight and your weights by your side, you're going to take a large step back with the same leg that you use as your step out for your squat. At the same time, you're going to curl your biceps, contracting your muscles, lower your hips, so that the opposite leg's thigh becomes parallel to the floor. The knee position is over your ankle. From here, you're going to push off that working leg whilst lowering your weight and repeat. You will then repeat this whole first section of the workout using your opposite leg. Moving on to the second section of this workout, we're going on to our tricep extensions. So you're going to hold the dumbbells with both hands above your head. You're going to bend your elbows so that it's around a 90 degree angle with your upper arm still straight. You're then going to push the dumbbell up over your head, contracting your triceps and repeat. We are now going to combine our squat with our press. So you're going to hold the weight close to your chest, keeping your core tight and your shoulders back. You're then going to squat down with your toes and knees both pointed out slightly. And as you push back up out of your squat, you're going to raise that weight above your head before returning it back to your chest and going back into your squat. We are then going to combine all three together. 
So hold your weight comfortably so that you can squat down and press it up and do your tricep extension. Then bring it back into your chest and repeat. The third section of our workout is a renegade row into a press up. So you're going to get into a press up position with a dumbbell in each hand. The weighter your legs are makes it a bit easier. So keeping your core nice and engaged, you're going to lower your body to the floor, then push back up. From there, you're then going to row the weight upwards until your upper arm is slightly higher than your torso. And then again, repeat with the other side. To make this a bit easier, you can do it on your knees or you can do the two exercises separately. The fourth section of this workout is our glute bridge. So you're going to lie on your back with your knees bent and you're going to hold the weight on your hips. You're going to push through your heels, squeeze your glutes and your core, lift your hips nice and high off the ground until your hips, knees and shoulders are in a straight line. You're then going to lower your body to the ground and repeat. We are then on to our weighted sit up. So you're going to lie on your back with your knees bent and the weight behind your head so that you can get a good stretch in your core. You're going to embrace your core and reach that weight up nice and high. You're then going to lower your body and put that weight behind your head and repeat nice and controlled. And you guessed it, we are now combining our glute bridge, not with a sit up though, with a crunch. So you're going to do your glute bridge, lower your body, and then you're going to crunch. So with your crunch, you want to keep your head and your neck nice and relaxed. That is the demo complete. So stick your music on, have your water, and let's go and beast this workout. But it's too late now, I remember you and me. And how careless we yeah. be. All day and all night, we'd stay up, it felt so right. We were so young, we were so dumb, we would get drunk and then hook up. We were okay, we were alright, staying awake till the sunrise. We were in love, couldn't stop us, like a good drug, yeah. never run. We hook up in my car, driving so far, play your guitar, you'd show me your wrong. Let down our guards, think with our hearts, stare at the stars, we were never apart. Drinking too young, way too much fun, out in the sun. Open when it's gone Took you to prom Dance to our song Dance all night long Till the lights come on Fearless, 
Reckless, time was precious We love to waste time, whiskey and wine Drinking all night, asleep by your side Finally arrived, we would just drive Never arrive, our journey was live Staying out late, testing our fate Running away, we live for today Young and so bold, never get old Screw what we're told, we can't be controlled
got a body like a ghost She likes to keep the party going These rumors got me feeling lonely I want that body, baby, show me She's got a body like a ghost She likes to keep the party going Show me I get what I need Every single day I'm heading off to my dream And I get everything that I damn well please I don't give a damn if you all listening to me Cause I run it I'm the only one that really want it I'm the only one that's really on it I'm just being honest I'm just doing everything I promise Cause I want it bad enough that I'ma make it as an artist And I know I'm not the smartest And I know I'm not the largest But I promise you that I'ma be the one that worked the hardest Cause I promise you that I'm just getting started And I promise you that my skills are getting sharper So I'ma get charted Can't be guarded Nah, I'm the one to get retarded Get the party started Yeah, get the party started Yeah, so let me get up on it Yeah, bitch you got me fucked up I don't know what's up Pour that shit in my cup We bout to turn up Crank this shit up so loud Sounds like we're sold out In front of a whole That's crowd We lose yeah. control now Don't take this shit too personally Everybody got a different version of me Everybody gotta be learning from me Everybody wanna be working with me And I feel like there's uncertainty and urgency To find out what you wanna be But honestly, we change our minds constantly So stop and breathe and find out who you wanna be So I be cautious, I hope that you're watching Don't try to stop this, work until I'm nauseous Cause I will not quit, no because I want this Don't try to stop me, never ain't an option So I be cautious, I hope that you're watching Don't try to stop this, work until I'm nauseous how did you do? I really loved recording this workout. It really got the heart rate up and you really could feel it all over your body. How did you do? Let me know in the comments below. Did you change the rep range? Did you do anything different? Tell your girl. I want to know everything. So make sure you leave a comment. So if you like this workout, please give it a like. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Feedback is feedback, baby. But I do hope you enjoyed it obviously. Now for the all over important question, if you're stuck around this far, thank you! So I have two questions. My first question is do you watch the demonstration videos at the beginning? Because if you don't, I might take them out of the videos altogether, but if one person benefits from it, if one person watches the demonstrations and wants the demonstrations to stay, then by all means they will definitely be staying, so just let me know in the comments below. My second question, most of my workout videos are around 10 minutes long. Do you like that? Or would you rather a longer video where we do it together and it lasts about half an hour? Like, would you rather we repeated it together or would you rather it was just a full session of something different the whole time? Or for example, this workout, if we had it in it three times together, would that push you a wee bit more? If that's something that you would like, let me know in the comments below and we will definitely put that in to future videos. So without further ado, make sure you're subscribing, please like, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!